All right, guys and gals, ladies and gents, the Franken Axial, renamed after I had built this truck to the gatekeeper because it has a casket built into the bed. <laughs> Way back before there was a element gatekeeper. Uh, this is the original honcho body, little paint job on it. Um, I am running the uh, Chinese steel axles, aluminum axles, sorry, <clears throat> servo on axle. Uh, I do have the Ready RC um, SC480X servo, or receipt, shit, sorry, ESC and the uh, 20 turn motor in it. I am running this on 3S. It uh, does have the uh, old RC World skid plate and uh, links, except for the top links. I had to redo that because I didn't like that single center. Um, and I am running the 120 millimeter um, Chinese internal coiled shocks. And I am running the really soft shocks. So uh, I know some people can say, oh, it's too much, but uh, this dude will flex. So we'll see how it does. Uh, oh, we'll see how it does. I'm hoping that uh, it'll do all right. This truck has not been out uh, for probably a year. Um, I do have a set of 100 millimeters. I'm probably going to run on this more than the 120s. And the only reason I'm gonna change them probably is because of the ground clearance or uh, height issues. steering which is a case with most of my rigs that take this course seems like I don't have very much to the left uh, I am running the axial capra wheels on this um, they are weighted with uh, car sticky weights on the wheel and uh, I'm running the 1.9 Pitbull Rock Beast XLs. And just for fun, I do have the Deadbolt, um, the old Deadbolt interior, well, the original Deadbolt uh, AX10 body cut, because I destroyed that body, but I took the driver and put him in here, so it does have a driver. Centered bad on the front axle. 